Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's a little bit of a different setup. I'm sitting in my car and I actually did not park far enough down the parking lot. So there's like people all around me. I feel so awkward. Um, today's video is going to be what's new at Walmart in stores. So last week I put last week, the week before recently I posted, um, like kind of what's new in fashion, home and beauty from Walmart, but it was like basically all online. There was like two items that you could get in store potentially. Um, so I wanted to just kind of pop in the store, see what's new. You guys love these Walmart videos. I feel like Walmart's so accessible and it's so affordable obviously as well. So anyway, I want to thank Walmart for sponsoring today's video and let's go shopping so starting off in beauty I saw that NYX came out with these new slim lip pencils and by the way everything will be linked below but I just thought that these had um, really nice color options and some that I would really gravitate towards with the pinky nudes the brown shades and then that nice poppy red was really pretty as well um, sorry I'm doing this voice over while the baby's playing next to me so if you hear um, some noise that's why but I also saw these Wet n Wild Color Icon palettes. These were under $5, guys. I thought these looked really nice, and I liked the colors. And then I also saw this Tinted Hydrator. This had hyaluronic acid in it, which my skin responds really well to. So I'm very intrigued by this and had not seen it before. So I felt like this would be a good option um, for like a foundation in the summer. And then I also saw these Plumping um, Serum Lip Balms, which I actually bought this color and really, really like it. Um, it does kind of feel like you have cinnamon on your lips, but that's like the plumping effect, I suppose. But yeah, those were by Hard Candy, very, very affordable and something I hadn't seen before. And then Thea's Super Stay Active Wear Foundation. I had not seen the Active Wear um, before, but I absolutely love the Super Stay Foundation, so I would assume that I would love this just as much. And they have a great shade range along with a large shade range online as well and then I also saw this Maybelline glass spray this really caught my eye I love like a glossy finish so yeah I hadn't seen that and it looked really really nice and then I saw this Carter Beauty display they had some really fun lip uh, products and whatnot and then they had some really nice palettes as well again super affordable with a lot of variation and colors and things like that so that was right on a standout so kind of caught my eye and then this Neutrogena line was new and it has skin balancing with skin perfecting um, products so there's like a cleanser and a toner that kind of go hand in hand and I saw three different kind of like skin focused um, does that make sense skin focused ones <laughs> if you know what I'm saying so moving on into fashion, I loved this linen dress. It was so soft and just looked like it'd be really easy to throw on and go. Um, and a flattering silhouette you would think with the belt and I loved that ruffle at the bottom as well. So they had a couple different colors in that. And then I also loved this romper. I actually saw this last time I was at Walmart and almost bought it then. And I almost bought it this day too, but I'm just trying to slim down with our move coming up. But um, yeah, I absolutely love this. They had a bunch of different colors. I like the striped ones, but I could just see that gray one with some sneakers and a ball cap or something. I feel like that'd be really cute and easy. So love that. And then I also saw these uh, midi dresses. So these are just like a v-neck, classic kind of tank dress, easy t-shirt style. And I really like the fabric again. It just kind of felt like it would lay nice. And it's funny because we ended up going to camp and my mom was actually wearing this, I believe in the black. And then she also wore the green one um, while we were there. So. She said she absolutely loves them. I saw these shorts by Time and True that were so soft, guys. If you're looking for some comfy shorts, highly, highly recommend. Throw on a tank and some sandals, you're good to go. And I also saw these Sofia Vigara tops. I had seen these online and thought they were really cute, but they were even better in person. The lace detail is just so pretty. The color options were great, and the quality just felt really good as well. Like the weight of it and everything, I felt like would just lay on the body. So it is an off the shoulder top, by the way. Um, yeah, just thought that was really pretty. And then I also saw these tops. I bought the gray one to wear at camp with some leggings. I loved this raw hem at the bottom. Just easy to throw on. I thought it'd be really cute with like a denim jacket, but they had a couple different colors. Cute, easy. You could wear it for athleisure wear or just kind of lounge wear as well, but really loved that. And along with athleisure wear, I found this top, which I thought would be so cute um, with some leggings and sneakers and again, a ball cap just something easy to throw on the fabric of these was so good it was like a stretchy um, kind of rayon type of material something that feels really good on the body and lays really nicely 
Um, and then one of their plus size um, dresses that I found that I absolutely loved. I was actually bummed they didn't have it in my size, but I just thought this was so cute. It's a tiered skirt. The weight of this fabric was so good, and I loved this raw hem. I thought this made it look so much more expensive. Definitely surprised me to find right at Walmart, and I love the ruffled shoulder and the fact that it has pockets. They had so many different color options, and yeah, I'm telling you guys, the fabric of this felt so high-end. So next I found this bathing suit cover up and I actually discovered the green one behind it which I ended up falling in love with even more. But I just thought these were a really great option. They were around $20 and this green one is just beautiful. I feel like you could even wear this for like a maternity shoot over a fitted dress or something like that and it would be really pretty. I love the d double tie in the front with the lace details and the color, it's so good. So moving on to home goods, I found these baskets. I thought these would be really cute in a pantry to kind of organize like little snacks or you know like small chip bags or something like that and just kind of keep things still like aesthetically pleasing at the same time. So I thought those were really cute. And I also found this mirror that I thought was really, really pretty. Not everyone's style, but I do feel like you could kind of make it you know fit your home depending on like the rest of your decor so they showed a few different ways to style it here and it was a very very good size it was under a hundred dollars and I liked the color of the wood as well so next up I found these lamps that I fell in love with I think these would be stunning um, on a nightstand to kind of like frame your bed um, and just kind of make a statement in any room obviously it'd be really pretty on a desk as well I may actually get this for my office when we move um, which I still need to update you guys on so stay tuned for some life updates but um, I also saw some of the beautiful line by uh, Drew Barrymore in store, which I hadn't seen yet. So this knife set I've had my eye on for the longest time, and I'm definitely going to purchase once we get into our new house. But I also had the air fryer. I saw that in store as well, but I'll link um, like her entire line down below because I have the coffee maker, the air fryer, and I'm obsessed. But anyway, I love these bamboo um, organizers. I felt like these would be really aesthetically pleasing to organize any drawer in your home, specifically the kitchen is kind of what they are geared towards. But um, yeah, and then I also found this shower curtain that I thought was really cute. If you kind of have that like bold farmhousey kind of vibe in your house, this was really nice quality. The palms were like really nice and thick, and um, I just thought it was really good for the price. And then this one I found that's a little more simple. It's kind of got that linen um, feel to it with the subtle uh, change in texture, creating like a polka dot pattern. But this one actually came with the clear. Uh, curtain as well with the hooks so this was like really really inexpensive for your whole kind of shower get up and I thought that was a great deal and then in the rugs I found this rug I really liked the natural color um, the one I linked below I actually found one that has a much better uh, pattern in my opinion one that looks more expensive so I'll link that one for you guys but this was so so soft and I could really see it working in so many different um, rooms of the house. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching. Thank you again to Walmart for sponsoring today's video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.